want to recognize um, them for advancing to uh, the state here at EIU this past spring, and I'll let Coach Hawk talk a little bit about you know how they advanced and how they did. Okay, I'll, I probably bragged about them both quite a bit this year, but I'll, I'll do a little bit more because I like I do like doing that. Um, Megan couldn't make it. I'll talk about her first, and I can say whatever I want since she's not here. <laughs> <laughs> um, Megan was a senior this year. She missed. She I mean, track is kind of her thing, and she missed out last year. So it was it was cool to see how much she put into preparing for this season. Before the season ever hit, she was uh, setting new school records. That our, our concern was, are these going to count? Because she's getting these before we ever started. But we didn't have to wait too long. Um, I think our first meet, she kind of started setting those again. So Megan set three school records this year, um, really just dominated all year long. She, her freshman year, her sophomore year, she placed sixth in the state in the 800. This year she placed fifth and she was disappointed in that. So that shows you how good she is. Um, we're gonna we're gonna miss her, but she's moving on to Adams State next year in Colorado, which is a one of the top, um, I think it's, I think it's Division II, um, smaller schools, um, but, but one of the top ones in the country where she plans to, to do really well. I expect her to do really well, and it's going to be fun to see. But So, yeah, so Megan Garrett. Yep, and then I believe it was the 400, 800, and 1600, right? Were those the three records? It was the, yeah, 400, 800, and 1600. I tried to convince her. I thought she might be able to set a couple more if she tried, but she, that was enough. <laughs> three was <laughs> <one. laughs> <So, laughs> funny. That was <laughs> funny. Congratulations to her and then McKenna. Uh, McKenna. Um, McKenna was an interesting case this year because she was our only returning underclassman. She was a junior this year that lettered as a freshman. As a sophomore, she didn't get to compete again. So this year she came in she had respectable times as a freshman in the 100, the 200. They were they were pretty good, but this year in her first meet, she set new PRs in both the 100 and the 200. And all year long, she was first and second basically every single meet. I was looking back at it today, and she she ran in 10 different meets, the 100 and the 200. And I think in the 200, she got third twice. And one of those times was in sectionals, which just kept her from going to state in the 200. And uh, coincidentally, the the person that beat her for second place and got to go to state set a new school record for Unity by beating her. So, I mean, that shows you where she was at. In the 100, she was first or second the entire year. Never got less than second until the state meet. So, remarkable junior year. Can't wait to see what she does as a senior. Um, and just one more little thing that's kind of interesting and fun. We, we set on the track team a limit of, if they make 20 points, 20 varsity points throughout the year, that's enough to earn their varsity letter. So um, that's kind of the benchmark, 20 points all year long. McKenna scored 148 this year. So she basically lettered seven and a half times. <laughs> Pretty good. Yeah, well congratulations yep. to you.